se lo corian mande y gusto por recande, lando lo corian son. And thus saith Almighty God, Sid Roth, my chosen child, one in whom I am well pleased, before the foundations of the earth, I knew you. I knew you before you were formed in your mother's womb. And before the foundations of the earth, I ordained you to be a last day's apostle of signs and wonders. For you see, a true apostle of God is a sent one that has miraculous powers, gifts of the Holy Ghost, and signs and wonders. Signs being supernatural miracles in the senses realm, proving that Jesus Christ is Lord. And wonders being supernatural miracles in the imagination realm, proving that Jesus Christ is Lord. And see, I've called you, and I've sent you, and you've gone. You've gone, and you continually go on a daily basis for many years now across the waters, across the seas, across the nations by way of TV. Yes, you are truly a sent one, and it will be magnified that much more than you could imagine, saith the Spirit of God. And not only will you flow with this last day's signs and wonders of being in that office of an apostle, and the anointing of God will flow out of you just like it would radiate and flow out of me, saith the Spirit of God, as I've described in the book of Habakkuk chapter 3 and verse 3 and 4, where that the sunlight splendor of God streamed forth out of my being. And that sunlight splendor, in that sunlight splendor, is and was the hiding place of my greatest power. Now it'll flow out of you, saith the Spirit of God. It'll flow out just as easy as breathing. If you remember, if you recall, the first man, Adam, he was merely just a piece of clay. But I breathed into his nostrils the breath of life. I breathed into him the Shekinah glory and power. And now... Sid Roth, you have that Shekinah glory and power inside of you, so you will breathe it out. And the Shekinah glory and power, brighter than the sunlight splendor, will stream like lightning bolts that'll come when you speak the Word of God, and it'll transform people into the last day signs and wonders ministry. Your eyes will cause the sunlight. There'll be vessels where the, the sunlight splendor will also beam out of your eyes, out of your touch, saith the Spirit of God. Yes, it'll be easier than breathing. And not only have I called you to be in this apostleship of the last day's signs and wonders, but the greatest thing is that you have already begun to teach people on a worldwide basis You've inspired people, even young children, to flow in the last day signs and wonders, but it will intensify and the simplicity will even get greater and the anointing will be greater. And as I said in my word, eyes have never seen, ears have never heard. It's never entered into the heart of a human being the things that I have prepared, but it shall be revealed by the Spirit of God to you, said Roth, and then you'll share it with many others. And the purpose of this is to bring in the last day's great harvest, a sea of people to be taken up into the rapture. And thus saith the Spirit of God, Oh, Sid Roth, it'll be so easy. It'll be so fun, saith the Spirit of God. So now go forth and simply enjoy life and see good days saith the Spirit of God, as you represent me in the highest order to bring the masses into the kingdom of God, being that representation and that teacher and that apostle. Go forth, saith the Spirit of God, and go forth with joy and go forth with simplicity. Thus saith the Spirit of God. I'm well pleased with you, my servant. Amen.